Yeah, for that. It's kind of nice it is with the trees in the water, eh? Yeah. Oh, look, Erica. What? Look. Aww. It's a raccoon. It's so cute. Look at it. It's so big. He's so cute. <laughs> A raccoon, yeah. And that's why I don't know. He's Yeah, they're very clean raccoons. I think I would love living down Louisiana or the, down by the bayou. Hey? I would love it. Oh, here comes the rain. Could that be future chicken of the woods? Possible. There's more things growing there. I love nature. So my daughter and I were saying that basically what we forage today is basically a meal for us. We were able to find some saddleback and we found some beautiful morels, which pretty much makes it easy for us because they're very close to the edge of the woods, but yet they are the same color as these leaves. And that part is a little hard, but think about it. One time, this is what people did, right? They went out and they foraged for food and they worked hard. It's like we've been out here now, it's two hours, and we've pretty much picked a meal for ourselves. I mean, there's other things we could have picked that we didn't bother, like wild chicory and a few other things. But we also got a workout, and we got some fresh air. So is it worth it? I think it's worth it. Especially at the price of morels. I can't even tell you what morels cost. They're one of the most sought out mushrooms. Very expensive. And so delicious. I can't even tell you. There is no mushroom out there that is, that is as good as a morel. Right, Erica? Mm -hmm. It is just something else. And it's like I'm always afraid to walk. I'm never sure if I'm stepping on one or... And usually, you have to move the leaves around unless you're lucky to see one popping out. And thanks to all these fallen trees, it's an obstacle ride. So good workout on the legs, that's for sure. I thought I saw something red because now is also the season for chanterelles. If we're lucky. Right, Eric? Yeah. Oh. What do we see? Hold on, Eric. It's a freaking oyster, but it's not No ready. way. Look, Let me see. Look. They're not ready. Yeah, it's, the, oh, look at that. Oysters. Oh, they're not, not ready. ready. Oh. You're going to have to remember this. Are you going to remember where to come uh. for the oysters? No, you're not. <laughs> This is going to be difficult to uh, remember. remember. Man. There you go. Oyster time has started also. Look how beautiful those and are. And this is a Good brand new fallen tree. So when this gets invaded with the oyster mushroom. Oh, more, hold on. Let me, we have to look at this tree. Just to make sure we don't miss anything. I want to take a picture of this. 
when the oysters start invading, this whole tree is going to be covered, covered in oyster mushrooms. And who's going to be the lucky one to come first? We are. <laughs> we are? We are. Law of attraction. Law of attraction, okay. I like that. Okay. And what else are you looking at? Oh yeah, there's more over here. Look, yeah. they're starting. They're Ow. starting. Ow, Erica, you're gonna hurt yourself. Sorry. Hold on, I'm coming. They're too small to be picked. But now is the time. I told you now is oyster morels. Well, morels almost done. There's another. There, there's another oyster mushroom that's just popping its head, and this is gonna make clusters, clusters. So Too bad we can't hide this tree. <laughs> well, people don't usually come in here, so. But it's just sad that it's not ready. Okay, which way are we going now? I'm so well, lost. Well, we could go anywhere, and then we get, the path is right next to us, so we can okay. stay here and keep looking. So sad that they don't look No, they're not ready. Maybe let's just put it down on the wall. Well, there's going to be a lot of oysters on this one. It's a new tree. It's going to get invaded really fast. If you're lucky, you can find them on the top of the tree that's still standing or on fallen trees. Yeah, tree. Here's, look, another one right there, Erica. That's the one we saw. Is it? Yeah. I bet if you go all the way down, you're going to see. That's the one we saw. That's so sad. I want to see. I want more morels. I want three oysters, too. Oh, the oyster's not ready. Those are the only oysters we eat. I used to love eating oysters, guys. Oh my God. My daughter and I would put those oysters back like it was nobody's business. Come on, find me more else. We'll never find this area again, Erica. Yeah, we will. You think? So? You remember when we see here, watch. Yeah. When we're on the path and we see those, you see over there near the path, there's like a trunk like that. You see it? Yeah, you know that it's going to be yeah, inside. So well, you remember that, okay? My head is too, my head is too crowded. My head is too busy. My head is overloaded with information. Mine's an old head. Turkey tails. By the way, turkey tails are also very great to harvest, especially new ones. If I find any new ones, I'll show you. They're very medicinal. And you can... Uh, Let's go further down that way. Feel that way. Which way? Down that way. No, go back here. This way. What's on this tree? Anyhow, the turkey tails are great to harvest, and you could also harvest them dry. And they're very medicinal. You make tea with it. Isn't that beautiful? My God, I can live in here. Close to nature. I just want to be close to nature. A lighter, does it work? Hey, I gotta make sure it doesn't catch my hair. No, but we'll throw it out. Yeah, I'll put it in garbage. Put it in there with the, uh, I'll throw that out in the garbage. Why do people just throw things anywhere? Man, I can't believe there's two Well, those oysters are not ready. It gets too sunny oh, and hot. To, uh, well, if it gets sunny and hot, they might dry up. Yeah, Wish I could show you. Too bad I didn't record when we found the morels. It was like, hallelujah. What do you see, Erica, besides a fallen tree? I'm looking. Wow. Hmm? It's 
rainy. Doesn't feel like it's raining on us in the woods. It is raining, but you don't feel any rain in here. Okay, Eric. Oh. Are we crossing over here? Are we crossing over? On that path. All these falling trees overhead. You gotta be careful. Kind of scary when you hear some of these old dead trees and the wind takes them. I'm all over the place. Look for morales, Erica. We'll even take some baby saddlebacks. Do you hear this under my feet? Okay, guys, I'll see you in a bit. You see this, guys? I want to show you. We have a bag full. Look at that. And when you cut these, you don't want to rip them out. You want to kind of pinch them. I'm not sure if you can see it. My daughter's got the knife, but you want to kind of break it off from the end. And that tells you it's a true morel because it's completely hollow. But you do not want to rip it out. And hopefully we'll find some more today. Erica? Yeah. Can you just grab this? Because I can't do this with... I need this. I need the food. There it is. And that's what we found today so far. Mm -hmm. Quite a bit. They're nice and big. They are nice and big. Is there anything else over here? Well, let's keep walking. I'm sure we're going to find My daughter's got the Hawkeye. The sun is trying to peep out, guys. This is the last of the morels now. After this, morels are going to be done. If we're lucky if we're going to find any in the month, the early June. But it was drizzling this morning. It's like trying to find Waldo. There's Erica. Hi, Erica. And you got to look in between all of this. If you're lucky, you'll spot them with their heads popping out. They're very hard to find, but let me tell you something very rewarding. Those are one of the most sought out mushrooms ever. Erica, did we go through this path here? to find more so I can show you. It's so beautiful up here. Eric! I'm over here, love. Hey? Are you coming? Where are you? No. You're the one with the Hawkeye. I was lucky to, I found about two of them today. The rest my daughter found. For some reason, I'm able to see Saddleback. Mind you, Saddleback is in your face. But my daughter's got a Hawkeye. Or anything else. It's great to be young with great eyes, huh? For more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to Connie's Rawson Kitchen, give it a thumbs up, and share it with your friends.